Hello and welcome back to another episode of Bren Town. My name is Dave Bren. This is episode 9 and today we are taking another look back here at our new industrial zone. Um, we've got a couple of issues about to develop in our city that I've just kind of realized that this guy over here is like 90% full. This guy over here is 25% full so we are really going to need another landfill soon because this guy is going to fill up. And when it does, we're going to have a lot of service disruptions with trash over here. So I am going to kind of nip that in the bud right away. We're going to come over here and first thing I'm going to do is brace up this circle because I don't want that to get ruined. And I'm just going to take a one-way road, or not one-way, we don't want that. We're going to go in and just take a regular avenue. We'll take it back this way and this way. I know that's going to destroy that power line, but that's okay. Because I wanted to go in and replace it with these handy dandy transformers anyhow. I'll put one there. Oop, there we go. And there. I guess they're actually not really that great for going over long distances, so I'm just going to take those back. And I'm going to leave some space here because I know that I'm going to put probably two landfills. I was really kind of, uh, I think, dreaming when I thought I could get away with just one landfill before I get to the incinerator. It looks like I'm really going to need about three or four. So I'm just going to plop those two down there just to get us rolling. And I'm also going to set this guy to empty so that I can really just focus all my trash to this side of the town. And this is also kind of a problem because of the placement of this landfill. Uh, it's a little bit difficult for these guys to get back in here. And I'm going to need to adjust the roads in my one-way network over here for the industrial zone. I forgot to put a road in here, first of all. Um, but also we need to... Uh, this is not an actually a functional one-way road network because these guys aren't really getting any access to anything. Uh, cars can get in but not very easily get out. Uh, so I have to kind of figure that situation out. Okay. Um, in the meantime... Oh, the other thing we need to sort out is getting power over to this guy. And I think I'm going to go ahead and put in one more water pumping station. And I'm going to move these guys across the river so I have room to develop this riverside into a park. And I'm going to move this guy down over here. That's one, two, three. And then we're going to add in also a third sewage. There we go. These guys are connected to the pipe system. They've got power. These guys are connected and they need power. So we're gonna run a line across here. Great. Okay. So let's just go ahead and run that. I'll run it on two speed for now. <coughs> So, one thing that I think I want to do also to give my citizens some more options. Uh, once traffic starts to build up over here, I'm going to want another on-ramp over here. It actually seems to be running okay, so I'm not going to invest in that just yet. Uh, let me make sure these power lines... Well, these power lines aren't doing anything, so we can just get rid of those. Great. And let's come back over here. Alright, so... We really need to address the situation over here. I have $187,000, so that gives me plenty of money. So this industrial zone over here, I just kind of slapdash through it in here, and I didn't plan it out too much. So I think what I need to do is I'm going to make it a one-way throughput, 
And my thought is to have it one way, to have an intersection over here and another circle down over here. Let's take a look and see what we can do. Let's delete, delete, delete. I've got a intersection here, the same one as the other side. And we'll put that... Oh, actually, you know what? Before I do that, I will make a measurement. So the road I'm going to use actually through here is this... Not the six lane? Yeah, I don't have a three or four lane one way, so I'm going to have to go with the six lane one way. It's a little overkill. I think it's going to do the trick. I'm going to give it ten out. And then we're going to throw in a small roundabout. Uh, does not want to line up properly. Is that going to be 90 degrees? Yeah, okay. And we'll upgrade that. There we go. This will be six lane around about here as will this. I may have to rebuild all of that circle in a bit. Okay. But we're also going to upgrade all of this into six lane one way, just like that. Okay. And now I will put in my intersection and kind of get it about lined up with that circle. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty good right there. We'll delete this, this, and this. We gotta put in some bracing for our circle so it doesn't collapse on us. There we go. And let's just start fresh with this ramp. Coming in right there. And this one coming in right there. doesn't want me to do that, darn. I may have to start it there. I hope it'll let me do that. Yeah, there we go, perfect. Okay, so that'll be the on-ramp there. These can go straight. Okay, now in terms of our directions here, oh, well, let me fix up this guy before we go any further. Right about there. Delete, delete, delete. We'll have to do those power lines again. is attached. There we go. Alright, so that way trucks can just kind of come straight through and then get out over there. And then, once they're in, they can go up any of these roads and then get access to any of the buildings either here or any of the ones here and then once they're done they come all the way back to the beginning and scooch back out. Now that could potentially be a little bit of a traffic problem right here. I'm going to make this come in. This goes all the way this way. Maybe what I'll do is do it every other like this, uh, but still keep these two. That way people don't have to come from back here, they don't have to come all the way back to the beginning. It's just this group of folks here that are coming back. 
Um, yeah, is that going to cause any traffic problems? See, the problem I have right now is there are people who can't get uh, places, and it's hard to figure out with one-way road networks how you can avoid people not getting completely abandoned where they're at. So let's just go ahead and run this on two speed. We're back. I'll run it on three speed for a second just to kind of see what kind of happens where. Now, one thing, I'll pause it real quick and just check out my junctions because that's going to be very important for this. We don't want to have any traffic lights here. We just want to have stop sign, stop sign. Stop sign, stop sign. Oh, we lost our power. I think I know why that is. Oh, and we've got some one ways going the wrong way. So let's see, what did I say? I wanted these ones back here to stay going out, 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 in, out, in. And let's check the electricity. There we go. That goes there, that goes across there. Okay. Let's run that again, three speed for just a second. Where are we zoned? Yeah, we got it all zoned. All right, so traffic is flowing in through here nicely. That's what I wanted to see. It doesn't look like a little bit of traffic backing up there. No, they're kind of flowing through nice. That's what I wanted to see. I just want to see people kind of come in and out and in and out. I don't want to see anything really backing up or slowing down too much. Um, it looks like it's doing pretty okay. Uh, now the thing about this is you can only, once you come in, you've got to go out over here. You don't have a choice. You can't come back and get to this circle to get back out because this is a one way. So that's the one thing where I'm not certain if this is going to really fly or not. But at any rate, uh, let's slow it down there and just make sure one thing I wanted to make sure is that we're not having any trash issues in the city, and we're not. We've got plenty of water. Ooh, electricity is running kind of low, so let's just go ahead and continue our clean energy project over here. I know this is not the most efficient, but I am making quite a lot of money, and I do like the look of that big hill filled with wind power. We have access to the oil power plant, but I think I won't place another power plant until we get the solar power or the nuclear power, and I'll kind of include that up here with my clean energy uh, area. Well, um, I think that's about a good place to stop for now. In the next episode, I think we're going to buy this tile down here and see if we can do an expansion on our residential, because we've got quite a lot of residential demand. And we are just trying to get to the big town milestone. Oh, no, or is it small city? Big town? Big town. Yeah, I think that's what we're trying to get to. Let me see here. Yes, that's it. Because we want that incineration plant. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please remember to like and subscribe. I really appreciate it, and I appreciate you guys for watching. This has been Brentown. My name is Dave Bren. I'll see you next time. Bye.